The majority of the poles that are here are not actually uh, Tlingit from this area. They are actually from uh, the Ketchikan area. Uh, they are Haida poles. Um, but they are very similar. Unfortunately, when he collected the poles, um, he did not know a lot about them. He did not know who carved them. He did not know the stories behind them. And they were unfortunately rotting away, and he did not know how old they were. Um, and if, about 1939 is when they began to re-carve them. So the ones that you see are actually the re-carvings. The originals, some of them are inside the visitor center. Some of them are in museums uh, around the country. Uh, this one is this one is a Haida pole, and it is carved out of one piece of yellow cedar, and it tells a story. However, we do not know what that story is. It has been lost. Uh, but the story is told from the bottom up, and a pole of this size, that story would take all day to tell. Uh, but the most important figure is the bottom figure. So our expression that to be on the bottom of the totem pole was a bad thing is actually inaccurate. Um, so this is a legend pole. These two on the side form the corners of the building. Um, and you can see that notch that's cut out on the top where those roof posts would rest to create that structure. Now these two look very similar, but they're actually a man and a woman. Can you guess which one is the woman? Yep, it is this one. She has her breast hanging over her arm, and also her bottom lip is sticking out because she's trying to look sexy. <laughs> okay. So there are a couple other types of poles. Uh, there are mortuary poles, um, and there would be a hole somewhere in that pole, and they would insert the ashes of that person inside the pole and you would see a group of them together, kind of like a cemetery. Also, there are shaming poles. If somebody in the village did something bad or wrong, a pole would be commissioned to tell the story of what that person did, and it would not come down until that person has been forgiven. They had their own scarlet letter. Um, so those are the very simple poles. Um, now, the majority of the poles are recarved or were carved out of red cedar, but we do not have any red cedar in our forest. Here. So that red cedar has to be brought up to down south. Let's go so that everybody can get.